Howdy doody! This is a new kind of video in which I tell a story from the game Gun. Today we are confronting the Sheriff of Town Empire because of his corruption. Because we hate corruption, obviously. Alright, let's see how this goes. Hey, kid. I'm nothing but your damn puppet. Is that what you think? Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy, kid. Who told you such a thing? Webb and Rudabaugh, before I plugged them both. They're dead? Just like you're gonna be. Kid, listen to me. That preacher you're looking for is in that room right now with Jenny. She lured him there. I was just coming to get you. Liar. Jenny! Steamboat. <laughs> yes. Bring him to me. I had to waste a perfectly good whore to get to the truth about you. Bastard. I could hardly believe it when she told me. Ned White, still alive after all those years. <laughs> now he's as dead as you're gonna be. Hang him in the morning for the murder of the girl. Well, that did not go as expected. And, uh, well, that one has a slick hand. And this would not be a western, western game if without some hanging. His old hoodoo's got the touch of a blacksmith, don't he? What did you do? Torched his printing press. You saw it. A subtle act of protest to silence the mouth of tyranny. That's soapy. He's educated. How come he's in there? It's a little game we play. They lock me up, and I find a way out. And you, my good man? How did you incur the mayor's disfavor? I killed Webb and Rudabaugh. I'm gonna kill Hoodoo, too, and a certain Jack Preacher, and that... One-eyed pig they work for. Thomas Magruder. Railroad man. He's taken over the territory. Us and the Apaches are the only ones fighting back. Count me in, too. As soon as we find the way out of here. All right. Not to get out of here. We have to come up with a plan. We're gonna get out of here tonight. That deputy's gotta die. See if you can grab him oh, when he gets okay. close to the bars. So how do we get him here? Oh, here we go. Lacey from the HJ sent over some chicken for your last meal. <laughs> but I'm afraid there isn't much left. <laughs> Besides, you don't want to shit yourself when you swing from that tree. Winner, right? winner, <laughs> chicken dinner. You don't know what's about to happen. I hear you was a little sneak that done cracked that safe. Give me the keys or you'll be slipping on your own guts. I, I don't got them, I swear. Hoodoo took them for safekeeping. So, so killing me won't do no good, you see. You'll still swing tomorrow. If you grab that badge he so enjoys degrading, you can use its pin to pick the cell lock. I'll tell you how if you promise to free me as well. Know what that makes you, partner? Hey, oh! Ooh, this human just lock cut box his they got me in is gonna be a little tougher. Dude. I'm afraid you're probably gonna have to blast me out of here if you hold fair to our deal. I'll hold fair. Let me stash some horses beneath the bridge, then I'll scrounge out back of the powder shop for something to blast you out. I ain't in much shape to fight, but if you get me out of here, I gotta hide out up in the mountains. Reckon that makes us partners, Soapy. Hope you're right about picking this lock. Now just give it to Jimmy, and she ought to turn loose. Ha <laughs> ha! Sweet as candy! Alright, let's give it a try. 
Here we go. No, no, no. It doesn't open. You're gonna have to give more specific information on that, or just let just try it again and. Oh, here we go. Grab your gear before you head out, kid. It's on the deputy's desk. Ooh, an Apache bow. Well, the note says that they had an Apache locked up the day before and he got executed and now they got his bow. Well, this will come in handy. I just wonder if we can collect the arrows that we shoot out. Let's see. Well, we don't have ammo for the rifle. Damn, ammo. That's not good. But we do have for the shotgun. And also the pistol, which is good. Now, as for the, those arrows, nope, we cannot pick them up later. Alright, Soapy, here we go. You'll do yourself a favor if you can stay out of sight. Try and bring these horses back real quiet like. Real quiet. I think that means that we're gonna use the bow to keep a low profile here. That's what it is. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Easy nut. Her belly began to rise. Her slit gave a grunt and out jumped a run with his balls between his eyes. Oh, the moon shines tonight. That's right. Singing and giving up the happy vibes just until I show up. We're not gonna take that path because I'm pretty sure they're gonna spot us there. So we're gonna go this way. Oh, that's right. Nope. How the hell did that guy spot me? Ooh. That arrow in the eye, though. Oh, yeah. Another headshot. God damn it. Take a quick, quick drink there. You didn't even have time to react. If you didn't know, guys, in the Western games, this key helps you heal because it fertilizes your wounds and it will make them up, heal them faster or something like that. Alright, let's get this horse under the bridge. I really hope nobody noticed the gunfires, although they were pretty loud, I, I was using the bow, but That's the other... The other camps are pretty f was pretty far. Now we're gonna try to use the bushes here for cover. Maybe don't they won't spot us. Oh no, they see us. These bushes don't do shit. Damn. I'm pretty destructive with this bow. This is a nice weapon, silent and deadly. Look at that neck shot. Now, if I'm not mistaken, there's another guy up here somewhere. Oh, no, there's not. So we're clear. Let's get this horse back to port under the bridge. So actually, the horses are gonna be our escape route when we're gonna get Soapy out from his cell. Then we're gonna hop on the horses and ride them out of town. Because that's faster. Not bad. Just one more, we can get out of here. You know that old cabin. Oh, this guy is telling a campfire bash. story. Well, let's hear it out. I'm quite interested. Meanwhile, we'll take a drink. Feel the vibe of the campfire. Seems her husband killed their 
Sean and tried to kill her too. And this is why. See, whenever folks was traveling, Damn it. By, this is taking too long. Spooky story, spooky campfire story, but I'm tired of waiting. I'm really sorry for this. All credit is due. It was a nice story. Oh, he wasn't the one telling the story. Here we go. But how did that guy just not see the other guy in front of him? Get an arrow on the back and die. That's terrible, dude. Oh, oh no! Who's telling the story? I think there's a ghost here. We better get the hell out of here. before you get near that power shower. Why don't you fire up the liver and get a whiskey bottle? That ought to get through to these men something to do while we get the hell out of here. Try and get a whiskey bomb into the hayloft. <laughs> that ought to get her going. Maybe a fire at the liver will draw folks' attention. That's actually a pretty good idea. Oh, I think there's a couple guys on the bridge. So we are gonna light the Empire City's haystack stock on fire. What a great idea! I know this serves as, as a distraction, but pretty bad idea. This could burn down the whole town. Oh my god. That lit up pretty quickly. And yes, they noticed. Still, let's keep it down here. Ooh, that shot in the stomach though. This bow is, is great, for even for short distance, a long distance as well. Alright, now for the gunpowder to bust out uh, Soapy here. We're gonna take this side of the town because I'm pretty sure all the guards are attracted by the fire now and are trying to put it out. So we're gonna try to take the rooftops to be more stealthy. Oh, no. We're not taking the rooftops. <laughs> try to be silent here. Whoa. I don't know how the hell did that guy just not spot me there. Maybe some gunpowder back here, behind the bar, no, nope, this is not gunpowder. Yeah, they're pretty occupied putting out the fire by the barn. Now I wonder, do I have to put this guy out or he just won't notice me? Nope. I got away. Clean and easy. Strong. It was nice knowing you, Soap. Let's get this back to Soapy. And bust him out. We'll take this way back. Oh, that's creaking. That's noisy. It's not good. Oh, this is not good either. Shit. Slipped from my hand. Hope nobody. Oh no, that wasn't loud. Nobody noticed. Alright. Now, I'm pretty sure the moment I shoot this and it blows up, I'm gonna notify the whole town that I'm here. Oh, sniper from from rooftop somewhere, so I'm pretty sure I was noticed already, so we're gonna 
gonna do this quick. Gonna be quick about it because I once already noticed. The moment I shoot this, they're gonna show up because they heard the explosions. Oh, here we go. Hustle, so be hustle. You guys go ahead, I'll cover you. Damn it, I got hit. Alright, now they're at safe distance, so I just have to go and catch up with them. Gentlemen, I regret to say this is where I fall. The calmer climbs of dear old Dodge are calling. So long, Soap. I wish you well. That's right. Let's get it moving. Because by now I'm pretty oh, sure they put out ass. all the fires and uh, rallying the troops to come after us. So let's get it moving. I'm taking you to meet Clay Allison. Clay and Magruder go way back. Magruder's been strong arming the whole territory looking for something, but no one knows what he's after. Come on. So, that's how you do a prison break in the West. Don't shoot, boys. It's Port. Port. It's good to see you. Uh, Ooh, how bad they treat you. They busted me up pretty good, but I, I didn't squawk none. This here's the fella who sprung me. Port, are you blind? This is one of Hoodoo's boys. Search him. We saw them shaking hands in front of the hotel. No, Clay. He's all right. He killed Webb and Rudabaugh. What the hell is this? You know this man? That's my father, Ned White. Bullshit. I served with Ned in the war. He was killed in action 10 years ago. You're mistaken, friend. Ned and I have been working the Rockies since I was a cub. Ned was murdered just a few weeks ago. Clay? He's after Thomas Magruder, just like us. I tracked the man behind Ned's death to Empire. Turns out he was working for Thomas Magruder. Ah, oh, want to get Magruder, do you? And every bastard on his payroll. Welcome to the Resistance. You can bet they've turned Empire into a fortress since your escape, but there may be a way in yet. Well, that was it. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, smash that like button and let me know if you want more episodes like, like this storytelling episode of The Gun. Let me know down in the comment section down below. And until next time, ho dee doo dee!